Hey guys, uh, back with another video here. Uh, my first, after my first ride review of the Mass FX tires. Uh, last weekend here in Ohio, it was it's been like you know 20s, uh, pretty cold, snowy. Uh, last weekend, last Saturday, actually we got some crazy weather roll through, and it was like low 50s. So. Uh, me and my family and my you know, one of my uh, best friends got together, went riding. Perfect time. Actually, this was the first time I actually got to uh, ride the 700, 700R and really open it up. So it was a perfect time to try out these uh, new Mass FX tires. <clears throat> uh, real quick rundown. The fronts are 21.710. The rears are 20.10.9. I just got them on a set of, uh, the rears are just stock. I don't know what they're off of, but, you know, Banshee, Warrior, YFZ, Raptor. Uh, rear wheels, the fronts are just stock Warrior wheels with a beadlock ring I welded on. <coughs> Excuse me. So, yeah, I took them out on the Raptor, um, and they did they did awesome, phenomenal. Uh, it, it was So it was super muddy. Like I was saying, it was, it's been cold, snowy, and all of a sudden everything thawed, super muddy. So, you know, I don't I don't really expect this type of tire to do like, you know, crazy good in, in a muddy condition, but it really did it really did shine. It did awesome. Um kind of a close up. You can you can actually still see where all the tire hairs, you know, like the little dots where the tire hairs were. You know, obviously, you know, they were like an inch or so long. You know, they're gonna be gone after the first ride. But they did awesome. The fronts. There we go. Nowhere on the fronts at all. Um, you know, the rears are going to see the most punishment by far, especially on a four wheel like four wheeler like this. Uh, I think these things are supposed to be supposed to put out like 48 horsepower stock. So this thing's either spinning, or uh, if it gets traction, you're you're doing you're doing a wheelie. So I mean. The power is insane on it. So it was a good test, you know, no flats. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, no funny business. Uh, the, they, they cleaned out really good, actually. You know, when I when I have to slow down or, or come to a stop or whatever, they'd kind of fill up with mud like any other tire. Uh, the fronts would clean out really fast. The rears, a blip of the throttle, and they'd clean out and, you know, start grabbing. Um, there were some cool hill climbs we found that I attempted and conquered. <laughs> conquered, I guess you could say. Um, made it without a problem. So, uh, yeah, I give them a thumbs up. Um, awesome tire, for the, especially for the price. You can't, you can't beat them. Um, these are actually the four-ply versions. I'm, I believe they make a six-ply version. So... It was it was a good test to see how they were gonna last. Um, I was kind of worried about the floor, the four ply, going through the woods and the sticks, you know, on the side walls. But uh, but yeah, they did really good. So a uh, big thumbs up, and uh, more videos to come of these tires on the Raptor and the Warrior. Um, any questions? Uh, you know, ask away. Like and subscribe, all that good stuff. I have an Instagram account as well, 917jolly. Give me a follow. Uh, most likely I'll follow you back. Uh, the Instagram account I do strictly four-wheeler uh, fabrication. And once the summer comes, when the Mustangs come out, um, I'll be posting about those. So, uh, so yeah, thank you guys, and uh, see you on the next one.